Good afternoon, one more video today. Sorry I'm coming to you looking so, ugh, no makeup. I'm really not feeling well this week. I'm not sure, I know I posted on my Instagram earlier that I thought I was having a sinus infection. That seems to be getting better, I'm not sure, but now I'm having like joint pain. I really don't freaking know what's going on. I don't feel well. I don't have any respiratory symptoms. I don't think it's COVID. I don't know, it's weird. I have to start my work weekend tomorrow, so. Yay. We'll see how that goes. But anyway, so sorry that you have to look at this. I'm excited because I finally got my customs from Rainbow Melts. Uh, I feel like I have been waiting for them for like a year. No one's fault. It's my anticipation that makes me feel that way. In fact, Crystal was so sweet because her customs was so bombarded because everyone loves her wax that on my um, paper that says what I ordered, whatever it's called, <laughs> <laughs> uh, she gave me a little um, code to take $10 off my next order because of the delay. I didn't expect that at all, but that was super kind of her. So um, I had heard about her customs from a few different people. I didn't order much because I didn't have, I don't have a ton of money to spend on wax. So you guys probably see, I do lots of small hauls. Um, but th so these were, I. she had a few different things you could do. You could order... Uh, in your customs loaves, you could order brittle bars or you could order these little squares. And the squares was the cheapest option. I think it was just the lowest amount of ounces of wax you could get. Um, and so I went with those. I also didn't make my own customs. Um, I don't have a lot of wax from Crystal or from, from Crystal, but from Rainbow Melts. So I actually got, I love Halloween. So I went and searched her page and I got three different scents that sh people loved from her Halloween and fall type um, orders, pre-orders or whatever. So that's what I got. Ones that people talked about a lot. They said they liked. And of course, ones that included notes that I knew I would like. So I ordered three squares, three square kit um, bundles. Um, the first one, I wish I remember how many ounces this was. Maybe it's on the bag. It's not, but it's a lot. I don't know if this is about eight ounces, 10 ounces. I should have looked that up. I'm sorry. But the first one that I ordered, uh, I think I had heard a few people talk about this um, as samples and as ones that they'd order loaves of in, in the past and they loved it. So the first one that she poured on just, just recently, July 19th, it was crisp and cozy. And that includes blackberry, juniper berries, eucalyptus, and sage. Yes, please. Crisp and cozy. And this, oh. So add you, add, you can see this bag. That's a ton of wax. And for three of these bags, this size, I paid $31 plus shipping. I mean, to me, this feels almost like 10 ounces. I'll have to look it up. I could be wrong. I don't know why it doesn't say on this paper. Sorry, I should have looked that up first. Anyway. So as you can kind of imagine with these notes, blackberry, juniper berries, eucalyptus, and sage, this almost smells like sweater weather, almost but less bitey because of that blackberry. Like it, like I love sweater weather, love, love, love sweater weather, but it sometimes gives me a really bad headache. There's a lot of scents that I love that give me really bad headaches. This I think would be a good tamed down sweater weather that I wouldn't get a headache from because that blackberry smooths out that sage and eucalyptus and juniper, which I love all of those notes so much. So I mostly, I think I'd say the top to me is juniper, then blackberry, then sage, then eucalyptus. But I definitely get that cooling eucalyptus. And man, that smells so good. So it smells almost like a fruity, smoothed out sweater weather is what this smells like to me. Crisp and cozy. Oh, that's so good. Okay, so the next one that I was really excited about <clears throat> excuse me. I felt like I saw this everywhere and everyone was talking about it and the notes like, yes. So rainbow melts, dark night, blackberry, Palo Santo and marshmallow fireside. Oh my gosh. Yes. Dark night. Palo Santo first is what I get first. And I've talked about before how Marshmallow Fireside, my nose, my brain, whatever the connection is, I don't get any sweetness from it. I kind of just get like a tamed down smokiness. So I do get that, the touch of that. 
I think I get blackberry. I might have to wait and see on warm. I might be getting blackberry, but to me it's mostly Palo Santo and marshmallow fireside. There is, oh, I closed it. There is a touch of fruitiness, but my, like my nose isn't identifying it just as blackberry. But, oh my gosh, that is definitely like, I mean, I could do this at night anytime, but that is definitely like a Halloween, mysterious, mm, woodsy, really good. That is really, really good. That was also poured on just a couple days ago, uh, July 19th of this year. Okay, and the last one, I also saw this on somebody's video. I'm sorry, I didn't write down who. Um, gosh, who was this? Was this? I can't remember. Anyways, this is Broomstick, Palo Santo, Lavender, Sage, and Citrus. I wanted some, some um, fall scents that weren't sweet because so many fall scents are sweet. Any of these I can add like, not that I like caramel, but I could add caramel too, or I could add some type of sweet fall something to it to make it that if I want to. There's so many sweet fall scents out there. Oh, wow. Whoa, this one's like next, next level. Hmm, what do I get first? I might get the lavender first, then sage, then Palo Santo, then there's definitely citrus though. Oh man, that is like a very interesting, interesting scent. I wish you could smell this through the camera. This is probably my favorite of the three. It's reminding me of something, not of another wax, of life, something in life, something realistic. Mm. Some good memory, whatever, whatever. That is, wow, broomstick is, mm-hmm. That is like mad, this is magic right here. If you want to try a non-sweet, somewhat smoky, but there's a brightness in it because of the citrus. And to me, sage is bright too. I know some people have issues with sage, whether it's headache inducing or um, just off-putting, but to me, sage is a really awakening, enlightening, clean love. I love the smell of sage in cooking and scents and everything. Wow, you must smell that. You must smell that if you get the chance. I'm sure she'll have it out on like a Halloween pre-order of some sort. I'm so happy to have this big old bag of that. Okay, and then I feel so thankful. She gave me this huge sample. Look how big this rainbow is. I mean, this is probably like three ounces, I'd say. And I don't know if she like looks at our pages to know in sense we like, or if she just picks something, I don't know. But this is Snuggle Island, Snuggle Laundry and Seaside Cotton. I like Snuggle, but I like Seaside Cotton better. Mmm, <sighs> I do get Snuggle, but I get more Seaside Cotton. Oh my goodness. Wow. Look how pretty too. Oh, a rainbow with all the colors of the rainbow on it. Oh my gosh. That smells like a laundry day to me. Like outdoor, fresh, holy freshness. Well, I'll be ordering some of that when it becomes offered because holy cow, that is amazing. That is good. I don't know if it says on the packaging, it doesn't say the weight on that. I would imagine it's about three ounces right around there. Wow. I am blown away by all of these. Like, I had never smelled, I think I said this in the end of the video, I had never smelled personally, not one of these before I ordered them, but just knowing a couple of pieces of wax that I've had from Crystal and watching reviews, reading reviews and the notes, I was like, there's no way that I could fail with those scents. And I did not, they're amazing. So this might not be as exciting as other people's Rainbow Melts customs where they've made their own customs and they're figuring out, oh, was that a good ratio? Was it this and that? I enjoy um, vendors' customs and what they put together. I really do. Uh, so I I'm so excited to have these. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope these it's an insight to some sense that she I think she's going to be putting out soon. So, you know, because the they're fall scents. I'm not sure, but I, I maybe. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this. I hope that, um, once again, you're staying well. You're staying safe. 
and that you're having a great summer day. Have fun. See you later.